Today's tip, how to align and manipulate text with an EasyBuilder Pro. When designing your project, you can use the tools within the font ribbon located within the Home tab to align and manipulate text. This is particularly useful when designing an application that supports multiple languages, as the difference in word length due to translation may mean that you have to spend more time aligning or resizing text within your project. To change the size of an object label, select an object, and then use the big and small font buttons to adjust the font size. Or, select multiple objects and choose a specific size within the size drop-down list. While an object is selected, you may use the font drop-down list to change the font used by a specific label and state. However, the fonts used across different languages are configured within the language and font settings. Text slash comment objects can be made italic or given an underline. And the color of any text can be changed using the color grid. There are three alignment utilities. Multi-lined text can be aligned using the alignment drop-down list on the left side. While the other alignment tools are used to align text within an object, such as a numeric object or bit lamp. The alignment, font color, and size can be duplicated among multiple states or languages using the duplicate drop-down list. And the format can be copied to another object using the copy formatting button. To move a label by hand, click on the object, and then click once more to select a label. Then, drag this label to the desired position. Although this can be quite tedious when an object has multiple states, and in such cases, I recommend using the position tracking button to ensure that labels maintain the same position across those states. One last feature I would like to demonstrate is the ability to quickly view the text for any state or language within your project. To change the current state or language of the objects shown, simply select the S or L button corresponding to the state or language that you would like to display, or enter a number within the numeric entry box in the state slash language ribbon. Thank you for watching this quick tip created by Wintech USA support. For more information about our software and our products, please visit wintechusa.com.